Now this one um, can be kind of tricky. Uh, if you put your mouse right on the shield, you can't always fire when the shield is up. Like, if you fire right in the shield, you know, you hit the wood, or stone rather. But if you um, put your mouse on the shield, and then you wait for the shield to go down, um, fire about a tick and a half, a little bit more than a tick for the first shot. The second one, second tick. And then three or more on the last one. Now this one's pretty tricky. Um, you have to hit the moving kunai target. Um, and then the bottom two are going to reflect off the shield and hit the side targets. And you have to hit the gong, um, but reflecting it off the right shield all in one throw. So I'm going to reset it here, but... You want full power and then a, two clicks to the right of being perfectly vertical. On this one, uh, a nice bookmark is that second haze mark and then full power. I usually use full power on that one. Um, kind of just look for the right angle. This one you want to get those three targets off that shield. And then you want to kind of arc it up and over. And I found that right on that symbol, on that kind of accent mark, if you do two and a half ticks, you're good to go on that one. We are picking up speed. Um, this one on the very left, kind of a little bit left of that wood mark, and a tick and a half. On this one, right below that stone wall at full force, and in the middle of the shield on this one, and then the very edge. Uh, a lot of people um, get stuck on this one, because, um, you know, stone can't be broken through, but if you read the description, element exchange, and you kind of test around, you'll find that the wood is stone, the bamboo is wood, and the stone is bamboo. So basically, you just want to lob it over. Check out where my mouse is. Um, right where that kind of O symbol is, and right below that other symbol, those two places. Well, uh, should should help you a bit. On this one, if you put your mouse just above that right target, uh, while your while your ninja is all the way to the right at full power, you'll ace that one. Um, this one, you just want to hit the target, um, basically in the middle or kind of up above that ocean line. And you should be alright. Not too many problems with that one. Now this one's kind of tricky. Um, I'm going to show you a freeze screen of the angle that you need, but you basically want that left side and that right side uh, just below the first tick. You can see here, uh, it's at the fourth stone piece, my mouse, um, and then all the way back and about one tick or under and then half a tick right here to just touch that target and get the gong. That one, that one's pretty tricky. <clears throat> On this one, just look at the gong and then full power at the shield and then just kind of hit that kunai target and then, you know, full power or whatever to hit the gong on there. Not too many problems with that one. You can just kind of wing it and sometimes get all the targets. Um, but basically, on this one, you want somewhere around that moon, and then, you know, any decent amount of power, three. I uh, freeze frame this one because I go pretty quick, but if you look, you can see I do about one and a half ticks, and then my mouse is uh, near that first target. Now, one isn't always that easy. <laughs> 
This one, um, just get that first target. And then this one, you have to wait. Um, at the edge of that wood, if you just barely click, it'll reflect off those shields and hit all the targets. 35. Um, this one goes pretty quick, so I'm going to end up resetting it. But basically, you want to full power the those three right there. Um, and then just a simple click, and then get it over that wall. Looks something like this. And then a lighter click up here. And then right between those two pieces of stone slab, you can actually full power. It's a nice, nice thing to know. Uh, 36 is really easy. You just look down and full power. Um, it's t the equivalent of, you know, Hello Kitty and My Little Pony and Dr. Mario. No, that game's hard. On <laughs> um, this one, here's some sweet, sweet bookmarks. That bottom red L right between those two shields full power full power on both and then this one at three ticks that T letter you can go through that like an animal this one full power um, almost straight up next to that little star it is, it is a nice bookmark but basically just messing around you can find that that one's, that one's pretty easy 39, this one, I usually take out the first bamboo, second bamboo. You want to hit that kunai target so that it spreads and hits those shields. So, let's go ahead and start things off. I usually take that one out to get some more room. And then, you just lob it up. And it'll take out those targets. And then, of course, you can uh, hit that bamboo and then the gong target. Uh, there's a nice, nice cool way of doing this too. Full power that one. Of course, wind up your um, shuriken for another kunai blast. And then check this out. If you go to that shield, uh, let's use that as a bookmark. That star. And then full power it. You can actually hit that gong and save yourself a shuriken. And maybe some time. This one's pretty awesome. This one was designed by Lee, and um, you can just throw shurikens around, and you probably won't figure out exactly what you're supposed to do. But here's the key. You can do it in two, actually. Um, right above the second tick. Uh, it can't be any more or any less. There's just that right angle. And then do the same angle kind of on that left side. I love that victory music. Sliveless walkthrough video. Alright, and then you can check out other high scores by um, people who waste their lives. My friend Mabe actually holds the uh, record. You can see I'm in second with 8 minutes, 24. He's an animal. Um, or maybe I just suck at this game. I probably that's it. But um you can see all the sweet scores right there. Hey, well thanks for watching this walkthrough video. Be sure to check out our website at dyadgames.com. We've got lots of other cool stuff. You can hit the media tab. We've got uh wallpapers, music, um gaming Lots of fun stuff for, you know, kids and grandmothers. We also have our development blog, which we keep you updated on new projects or you know, new patches or levels or anything like that. Um, we also have our Project Larry that we're really psyched about. Um, we'll be showing you some videos coming up here. Well, I hope you learned a few things, and thanks for watching.